Hey man, I'm going to shoot a real quick video here. I've got the strop laying down on my desk. <clears throat> this is the cutting edge. Uh, it's always going to be away from you. Kind of go down and flip on the spine. The spine obviously being the thicker part and come back. Okay, I'm doing it on top of the desk so you can see. Actually, for starting off, this is an effective stropping method. Um, you are still stropping the blade and everything. And then there's kind of my X pattern there. It's, you never flip on the blade. Obviously, you know, for obvious reasons, you cut your strop and everything. So make sure you flip on the spine. Um, you were asking, yeah, just keep it the way it, it lies right now is the way it's going to remain. Um, no pressure or anything. Just kind of got it along the strop there. I mean, a little bit of pressure, you know, keeping it taut. You want to make some contact with, with the blade to the leather. That's about it. <clears throat> um, but you can kind of see, you know, what I'm doing. I think it shows up a little bit better this way than, you know, on, on another, if the strop were hanging. Uh, see if I can't get a side view here for you before the battery dies. Hang on, buddy. I'll get you. It's kind of like that right there. Roll on the spine. And then come back. Roll on the spine and then back you're just yeah you're keeping it flat and see that the you got the edge on there and the spine on there and that's basically what we're going to hang or maintain rather it kind of looks like the spine isn't on there but it is in contact it's just uh the way the blade is yeah it looks like it's a gap but it's not it's just the, the way the spine is just like that Boom, that's dropping right there. I hope that helps you out a little bit. Hope it makes a little bit of sense. Um, I actually kind of like this way of dropping. It's pretty neat. If you're wondering, this is the uh, kangaroo slash uh, cowhide or cow leather um, strop that Le a member on the board Legion makes. Um, hand, hand makes these in Australia. They are... I mean, if you ever get into straps, th these are nice. He makes another one, too, with uh, buffalo hide. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> um, I'll probably get one of those, hopefully soon. But, I mean, you're looking at 100 bucks While you're on the camera, I'll throw a little toy, couple toys your way to look at. Uh, you got to pardon me with the, uh, say hello, puppy. With the moving around the room here. Okay, there's the tag. The hello tag. Well, can't really see it. There's the ESQ. Oh. Yeah, there you go. There's an Invicta I have. Oh. Uh, not a lot. I got, I narrowed down a lot of my collection over the past year or two. And there's the, um, what you call it? Oh, hang on. I'll go ahead and make a sample of the, uh, what I'm making a sample of, um, the ink, ink color. I'm going to do that on another video. That way it won't take three days to upload to you.